One time for the birthday chick. Two times for the birthday chick. Three times for the birthday chick. Go ahead and visit your birthday chick. Get up and visit your birthday. So it is my birthday. It's like so nice. Not fun. Today I thought I would do a get ready with me makeup and wig thing, whatever, because sorry, I'm a little, you know. Got my wine going on. So I was gonna put Hennessy in it to be Clatchet. Clatchet, y'all get classy ratchet, Clatchet. Thought I would do a get ready with me today because I'm not the best makeup person and especially when it comes to eyeshadow. So it's hilarious. I, I don't wear eyeshadows when first time putting on eyeshadows. So yeah, we in this together, y'all. Okay. Damn, I can't even do it. Okay. Okay. See, I'm so lame. I turned 29, so I'm old. So yeah. I thought that we would do a makeup thing together because I'm not your, your what, what, are the, what are those people called? The guru people, Mac, Mac people, I don't know. So we're gonna do some makeup together while I get ready to go out with my hubby because we're going out to dinner and we're gonna go see um, Sean, I'm gonna say Sean Williams, God damn, so I'm, Sarah, get, it together, get your life. Last night I turned up like with some tequila shots and other things that we're not gonna talk about yeah so but we're gonna go see sean wayne's later on and i thought you know let's go ahead and just get this makeup and this face together and i got a new wig i need to put some contacts in hold on i'm about to prime my face huh man you guys like a shit lamar i just started my videos what you gonna do A lot? <sighs> okay, sorry for the interruption. You know, the husband had to do his his business duties. Sorry for that. We real, we don't care. He had to take a shit, shit. He messed up my video. But anyway, let's get let's get, let's get back to the to this. Now as we said, I'm not a makeup guru. Um, you know, I just I know I know how to contour, I know how to highlight, but when it comes to doing all that extra stuff, like putting dots and eyeshadows and little, you know, unicorns on your eyebrows and stuff, I, I don't know how to do it. I did buy some eyeshadow from Ulta. Um, people was like, you know, get Tarte, you know, get, get, I don't know what all those other big name brands are. I don't know, but I wasn't about to pay $50 for no eyeshadow. So, I actually brought something called Revolution. Um, I used it, I, you know, I played around with it once and they're actually pretty colors. So we're gonna, you know, try that out today. And I'm just, you know, priming my face with the MAC Prep and Prime. I think I, I'm doing this right. Okay, so let's do eyebrows first. So let's, you know, have y'all get to know me. So I'm gonna look this way, that way, that way, hey, that way. Hey. I'm gonna look this way because my mirror is actually big enough this way and I can actually see. So y'all just going to like look at me, not looking at the camera. But let's get to know Sarah. So yes, my name is Sarah. Sarah Chapman to be exact. I got married um, about, when did I get married? A little over a year ago. Um, my, me and my husband, we actually got married in Jamaica because, you know, we was going to have a big wedding here, um, but I decided, you know, I wanted to have some small and plus. If you don't know me, I'm a huge fan of like radio music, nausea music, like, you know, to all my Americans, if y'all know anything about no dance hall, no nausea, African music, get hip, because that's like my favorite music to listen to. But either way, you know, that's why I wanted to get married in Jamaica, you know, I felt like those were my roots, you know, to get married in Jamaica. But it was an awesome wedding. Um, oh yeah, I'm using the Anastasia Dip Pro, the dip brow pomade in medium brown. Um, I'm not an eyebrow big, you know, guru either, so I usually just like line. Oh shit, that is right. Don't hate on makeup skills, y'all, okay? This is what is how do I make it, girl? But, um, so I said my birthday, May 3rd. So I just turned 29. So I'm actually getting ready, you know, this video is for me getting ready for my birthday and everything. So, 29. I am 6'2. Cut the music. 
I'm 6'2", y'all. Um, family tall, you know, my, my, my mama, she's 6'2", my daddy, he was 6'5". So, you know, I'm just born tall and curvy. So, that's something I definitely want to do with y'all is to have um, a tall and curvy lookbook because, you know, I see a lot of um, plus size girls, you know, which I admire because, you know, I'm technically plus size myself because I'm very, very curvy to be tall. But, um, you know, I see a lot of YouTube girls for the, uh, the curvy women, but when I want to buy the clothes, I don't know how tall these women are. So, you know, for all my ladies who's 5'11 and taller, it's hard for us to have like the right waistbands and to find the right lengths and clothes when, you know, half of the girls look amazing and bomb in it, you know, by boom. But, you know, it doesn't fit right on us because half of the pants look like high water on us or, you know, coochie cutters when it comes to the shorts. So, I definitely want to, you know, feature some of my favorite clothes that I have, that I wear, that I bought for my tall ladies over 5'11". So if that's something you definitely want to see, you know, coming up, definitely like this video to let me know, or just let me know in the comments of exactly, you know, what you want to see, because I'm, I'm definitely here to share my experience of being a tall woman and all of that. So, yeah, girl. Okay, so I basically just blended off camera because, like I said, y'all yeah, was making me nervous and I didn't know what I was doing. But I don't think it looks too bad. Like, it's not the best, but, you know, it's better compared... I'm putting sparkly on my eyes, y'all. It's better to having, like, just my, you know, contour face <laughs> with no eyeshadow, but... I don't know. It's not that bad. I think it's my camera too. You really can't pick it up with everything. But let's keep going and then we'll just, you know, figure it out afterwards. Alright, I had to do my little struggle uh, wings off the camera because I couldn't see. I don't look that bad. I think it's this camera though. Alright, let's put on some lashes, girl. You know, we can't do anything with our lashes. So yeah, this one lash. Y'all, Coachella was so lit. But one thing I can say about Coachella, the older you get, of course the tired you are. I was y'all, I was so pooped after the second day. My body was so tired, it was hot. <laughs> I was just ready to go home. But I had a great time. Like it's definitely for the young folk. Um, we didn't camp. Like we me and my friend, we actually had um, you know, the hotel. But I'm quite sure if y'all have seen the blog or blog, it's coming up. If it hasn't been uploaded yet, it's coming up because I have like a whole blog on that. And I will actually also be um, recording my trip to Cancun in two weeks. That should be lit. All right, eyelashes are on. Don't mind my bags. But um, foundation I'll be using is MAC NC 45. I think a lot of girls use NC45. Like, I feel like that's just a very popular color because every time I try to get at MAC, it's always sold out. But I do need to like try that Fenty because I heard, you know, that is amazing compared to this shit. I'm slowly coming together, y'all. Like... I know they said like use the the orange stuff you put underneath your under here, but I don't have any of that, so we might look a little crazy. Y'all, I'm slowly coming together. <laughs> Guys, this eyeshadow, just, this eyeshadow just changed my whole face. <laughs> oh God, oh God. All right, let me, I don't really clean sponges a lot sorry it's probably dirty but it's my dirt and I ain't had nothing happen to me yet on my face so now I'm taking my other pro um LA pro concealer in the color pure beige I'm not the only one that does this every time they call like like they don't like to do this they like <laughs> such a habit <laughs> got 
to YouTube is because I did a, I used to like I do a lot of crochets as you can tell from previous videos and I wear a lot of wigs and people always ask me questions about my hair how I did it you know about the wigs and I figured you know why not just go ahead and do what I said I wasn't gonna do and create a YouTube channel so here I am and besides like I said I wanted to do something for the tall and curvy women because like I said when it comes to videos and clothing hauls I see a lot of beautiful clothes on these you know plus size women but they're usually not you know meant for me because they're not in my lane the dresses don't look right on me because they're just not sh long enough and yeah so that's the whole reason why I eventually want to do uh, uh, fashion looks for the tall ladies. I don't drink for real. I mean, I do. I lied. I do drink. So for my contour, I use the City Color Contour Facts. I got this a long time ago. Oh, I got a reverse contour. See, look, look at me knowing stuff. All right, reverse contouring. Don't ask what it really is. I just know it makes your cheekbones look more stuffed in. I saw it on YouTube. Okay, girl, makeup is done. I don't think I look too bad, y'all. You see the hotline. I mean, the, the cheeks is contoured and popping. All right, guys. So we are done. Sorry, I'm like a little late, so I, I couldn't record everything else. But this is what the hair and the makeup looks like. So thank you guys for watching. Make sure you subscribe to my channel, like to my channel. I gotta get going because it's my birthday and I'm about to go turn up, bitch. All right, subscribe. See you soon. Bye.